I'm going to show you how a Pratt & Whitney PT6A34 works. It's an incredible piece of engineering. So over here, we'll start here. We have an accessory gear case here. In here, we have the compressor section. What happens is the air comes in through the back. It's a reverse flow. Comes in here through the blue area, in through axial compressor blades here, then into a centrifugal impeller here. That air then accelerates, goes through these little tubes into this blue area here in through the blue areas and it comes through here into the combustion area. You see those little holes? That's where the air by pressure is going to the combustion section. This is also where fuel is introduced and ignited so you get that fire. So you got a high air pressure coming in through here, then ignited gets even higher, goes through the compressor section here. This is all still connected with the compressor. So that turbine, then it comes over here and it's a free turbine, they're not connected, changes direction also and goes through the power turbine here and the power turbine is connected to the gearbox so that's where you get your reduction so back here this thing's uh, running at around 38,000 rpm the uh, power section here is run at 32,000 rpm then of course in the exhaust gas has come out here and out the tail so then there you see the propeller governor control there and then uh, that's how it works now on this side, real quick, we'll show you the intake. So here's the intake. Remember we talked about the intake, so that reverse flow comes in through here. And then over here is, is a beautiful uh, uh, view of the exhaust. And then here are the fuel uh, uh, lines in here, and the fuel nozzle, and then this is an example of one of the igniters. So that's a PT6A34 engine.